Noriega, Genghis Khan, Saddam Hussein, and me, the brain. We all have this one thing in common. We are into world domination. It's a new sensation. Try it and you'll feel elation. It's the gift to give the guy who wants everything. Military takeovers. Governmental makeovers. Good day, Tom, let me confide. It keeps your junta occupied. A reasonably promoted me after my victory at Batum. Look here at this dotted line. As overlord, I could combine and make this all one sovereign state. Oh, overlord, you are so great. I'll sew up this divided planet. My regime will surely span it. Yummy spammer, will you cut it? No, Pinky, you will. I'll learn the language if I must. You will gain the people's trust. I'll let them join my coterie. And you can buy their loyalty. They'll be the architects of their own destruction. There are several formulae I like to use for domination and to get the maximum effect out of a helpless nation. Crab meat or magnetic shoes, mind controlling peak to twos, or a giant signal tower to telecast my mental power. Think big, not small. Dominoes will start to fall. And then I can be the mouse who conquers man. So, if you have a calculator, you can be a great dictator. Let each country that you covet equal X. You're gonna love it. Multiply by why not try it? If the people start to riot, you can always say that they are just a bunch of kooks. People just need to be led by a mouse with a big head. To their weakness, they'll succumb. If you give them chewing gum, it may bother them a bit, but they'll soon get over it. They won't mind when I'm the czar of all, all that, that we see near and far. That went rather well, don't you, Brain? <laughs> now it's perfect. No.